looks very nice. If you happen to use a computer at a desk, whether it's for gaming, pleasure, or work, you definitely do need a mouse pad. Now the thing is, you can have one of those small, boring mouse pads in the office, or you can have a really cool, large, and in-charge mouse pad that's going to be great for just covering up your whole desk and bringing it more to life. So right here we have the Elizo Real Leather Giant Mouse Pad inside of this box. Now the box, it's a brown box with a sticker on it. It's literally as basic as it gets. So. I mean, a little bit disappointed on that front, but what's inside is what matters, and hopefully it's not just the box, because, yeah, it's, I don't know. I thought it'd have better packaging, to be honest. Not that the packaging necessarily matters, but as you know, you want to feel special when you're opening up a cool item like a real leather mouse pad. I don't know why they don't have a better box. Maybe they're new. But let's open this thing up and see what we got. So right here, we do have an initial thank you. Any feedback is greatly appreciated. So right now, Elizo, my feedback. Better packaging, better box. Wait, does it really matter? Because, I mean, we're just throwing the box away. Recycling that thing. But, I mean, you want to feel like you're opening up something nice, and this just, just didn't feel like it. So let's actually take off this plastic. Also, get rid of the plastic. Come on, we're trying to save the planet here. So we do have this little drawstring bag here this is actually pretty cool you see they they went pretty far with this they just need better packaging overall and more plastic okay come on we don't need all this plastic definitely not we have this why do we have this we have the plastic i mean obviously you can use this to carry it around when you move from place to place but it can it should still be able to protect it without this plastic come on two plastics why was they should they could have just had one plastic over this with the mouse pad inside. I'm going on too much. Okay, let's just move on. <laughs> That's my feedback. That's my feedback. So let's see, right here we actually have... Is this a coaster? So right here it looks like we have a real leather coaster as well for your drinks. Looks very nice. Nice aged leather. That looks very cool. Nice. I mean... That's definitely leather. Okay, now we have paper and tape. See, they, they went like overboard with this. I feel like instead of all this plastic and everything, I could have just used this paper and cut down on materials. And now we're going back to where I was and we just move on. But let's see what we got here. Okay, wow. Ooh. Okay, let me just clear this out the way. Oh, what? What is this? It looks like this is actually gonna be like to secure it when you roll it up and take it places. So this is very cool. So once again, we have that nice aged leather. Wow, that's leather. Feels very nice, looks great. We have these buttons on here. Let's see how good these buttons actually are. Okay, nice buttons. Very, very nice, okay. Hey, hold the horses, I just figured out. I guess you could use this to wrap the mouse pad when traveling, but this is actually a holder for whatever you want. So you just put these buttons together like so. <laughs> this is actually kind of cool. And just like that, you have this little holder you can put stuff in, like some AirPods, a little knife. That's a little bit too big. Some AirPods Pro. Some memory cards. You can just put stuff in here on your desk. That's nice. And remember, ah, it's leather now. Now back to where you were. And then here we go. Let me see. That's leather. This is leather. All right. So very nice. Looks like it. I'm hoping this will be grippy on the desk. Let's actually make some space here, shall we? Flip this thing on over and oh, wow. That felt nice. So this is definite leather. Has a nice aged look to it. Feels good. Now it's... It's sliding around a bit, but remember this is just basically just leather, so it is what it is, but I feel like there should, I mean, I guess it's not a big deal. Once you have your mouse on here, as you can see, it shouldn't be moved. Actually, I have a mouse right here. Let's get this mouse. Okay, working fine. Get the keyboard. Yeah, once you have the keyboard and mouse on here, this thing's not going to be moving, so we're fine on that front. Looks very nice. I mean, come on now. Look at, look at this. It actually goes really well with the black keyboard, the black mouse with this nice little copper tone to it. And, I mean, this looks, it matches so well. That looks so nice. I mean, this is a very nice thing. Let's see, the stitching looks good. No issues with the stitching that I can see. The leather itself. Now, as you can see on this part, 
it does feel a bit rough here it's not as smooth here but remember this is real leather so we are gonna have imperfections like that and that's what makes it so nice being that it's real leather i mean this thing feels good Ugh, smells like leather and it just, i mean this just looks nice this will work great i mean i guess this isn't mainly for gaming but obviously you can use it for gaming this is more of a more professional modest type look to it if you want something that's bright and punchy and gamey then this obviously isn't it but if you just want a nice real leather mouse pad that covers up a huge majority of your desk so you can use your mouse anywhere and have all your peripherals here and plus i mean come on this was really nice to see came with a coaster did not expect that coaster i got a cup of water right here let's actually get this right here no more rings on your desk okay and then this i mean I like the attention to detail here. What I didn't like was the packaging, but the product itself, wow, I'm impressed, I like it. 